All right, happy Monday, January the 15th. Man, this year's going to be kind of interesting. It's going to be fun. It, it, it's going to be different. The gathering and the word de written devotionals will follow the gathering and the word messages, which are actually going to be following this recording of the video. So uh, it's a different approach. Today, we're only going to consider Hebrews chapter 1, really verse 1, but I'm going to read all four verses to you. So here we go. Long ago, God spoke to our ancestors by the prophets at different times and in different ways, and in these last days, he has spoken to us by his son. God has appointed him heir of all things and made the universe through him. The son is the radiance of God's glory and the exact expression of his nature, sustaining all things by his powerful word. After making purification for sins, he sat down at the right hand of the majesty on high. So he became superior to the angels, just as the name he inherited is more excellent than theirs. See, because we believe this to be the word of God, the writer of Hebrews tells us that God spoke. God is telling us he spoke. God told us he spoke. We can then ask, how, when, and what did he speak? So as we approach these, these verses this year, I want you to kind of, there's three questions that when I read any passage of scripture, I ask myself. I, I first ask, what did God say? Second question, what did God say to me? Third question, what am I going to do about it? So I want you to consider Hebrews chapter 1, verse 1, particularly for today. Long ago, God spoke to our ancestors by the prophets at different times and in different ways. That's verse 1. What did God say? Well, what did he say to me? What am I going to do about it? It's great to consider. We'll be sharing these verses in the days ahead. See you tomorrow.